Hey guys, what's going on? This is Apple Investigator here, and in this video, I'm going to be telling you about how you're going to be able to get iOS 9 as soon as it becomes available after the WWDC keynote on June 9th. That is this coming Monday. So as you probably know, Apple will be holding its annual event at Moscow Center in California, and they will be unveiling iOS 9. Now, iOS 9, the beta version, will be released following this event, and normally it's supposed to just be for the developers who are working on applications and such. But even if you are just a member of the public and you want to get your hands on iOS 9, no problem at all. I can hook you guys up. Our good friends over at iOS Reg are going to get you guys going in a matter of just seconds, and I'm going to walk you guys through it right now. It literally just takes a few seconds to get going. It's fast, it's easy, it's secure, and it's the best and most reliable way that you're going to be able to run this iOS 9 beta on your device. So without further ado, let's get you started with iOS 9. Even though it hasn't been released, there are some steps that you can take right now to get your UDID registered, and then come Monday, you'll be all set to go. So let's get started. And all right, guys, now I'm going to go step by step and explain every detail that you need to know about getting iOS 9. Even though it has not been released yet and it is not Monday, there are some steps that you can take right now, some preliminary steps, especially to getting your UDID registered so that come Monday you're ready to go. So what you're going to want to do right now is head over to your web browser and you're going to want to go to iosreg.com iosreg.com I'll have this link down in the description below but you're going to want to go to this website and this is a trusted website this is instant UDID registration and essentially what this does is allows normal people who are not developers have access to the iOS betas so this is a service that's been around for a long time they've been doing this since iOS 5 they've done over 100,000 UDID activations since iOS 5 and I know that this is a credible business it's a trusted business and there's a lot of really bad scammers out there uh, especially little kids no offense to them but there are some younger developers who take your UDID and you just really don't know what they may be doing with that they could do some things to potentially harm your device or do something that you really don't want to have happened. So this site is fast, secure, and simple. 24-7, you can do this. It's got good support if you need help. And it's professional and, most importantly, secure. So this is actually one of the fastest services out there for activating your UDID. They can do it in about five seconds. So essentially what you do is you enter your device UDID, which I will show you guys how to get it momentarily here. And they will activate your UDID and once you're done that you can buy the instant UDID registration which just gives you the simple activation um, access to all the betas and a secure payment or you can also do the instant certificate and provisioning which gives you your code sign and also the ability to run your own apps uh, instant certificate and profile registration. Now, as you guys can see, the prices vary. It is about four pounds for the instant UDID registration and about six pounds for the certificate and provisioning. So you guys can decide which service you would like to purchase. Now, I will mention to you guys right now, if you go around looking for a similar UDID registration service, first of all, it is most likely more expensive than this. And second of all, it may not be secure. That is why I'm recommending this credible company. Just play it safe and get a quality UDID activation and you'll be set to go. So two great services that are offered here and you guys can decide which one you'd like to go ahead with. Now once you actually place your UDID in here you can actually track your order. You just enter your UDID and then it will give you the status of your order. Now once you do, uh, your order has gone through successfully. If we actually go to this, this will actually come up automatically but go to this page this will come up and it will say order placed successfully thanks for your order and hopefully by this time your thing is activated and you're ready to go so a great service this is the one that I definitely recommend um, for iOS 9 if you're interested in uh, getting the betas on your device now like I have said um, you're gonna need your UDID so we're actually going to navigate out of here and into iTunes once we're within iTunes here, I have my iPhone 6 Plus here. If we actually go to the details here, we see we have capacity, our phone number, and serial number. Obviously, I have blurred these out because I don't really want to give you guys this information. But if we do just click a mouse click on serial number, your UDID number will then 
up here. This is the unique device number that you're going to need. So what you're just going to want to do is you're going to want to get this number down and you're going to want to go back to the website and use it for purchasing because this is how they will register your device in the developer system so that you're eligible for the betas. Now, once you have this done and your UDID is activated, you'll be ready to go come Monday when the betas drop. Now, for every device, there will be a unique beta link, and it is rumored that it will be supported on A5 devices or later. So those are devices beginning with the iPad 2 or later, the iPad mini first generation or later, and the iPhone 4S or later. And that is not confirmed yet. We will know on Monday, but the rumor is that A5 devices and later will be supported. But if you are unsure right now, if we don't really know for sure, and if you don't want to take that risk, I would recommend waiting until Monday to purchase your UDID slot. But otherwise, you guys can go ahead and do that. Now, on Monday, once the link comes out, I will have all those linked down in the description. I will have a separate video, and it will also be on this video. But each link for every device will be down below. I'll have those linked, and I'll ensure that those are safe and secure links. And then essentially, the way that you're going to update is you see this check for update box. On a Mac, you're going to hold the option key and check for update down. And then you're going to browse for the IPSW file that you have downloaded. And this is the beta software that you're going to want to put on your device. Now, before you can do this, you are going to need your wipe to wipe your iPhone clean. So you're either going to have to back up your device to your iTunes library or back up to iCloud. You cannot do a fresh install of a beta unless you are running the latest version of Apple software fresh. So you can't have anything on your device. It just won't work. So you're going to want to wipe your device, back it up first, wipe your device, and then go ahead with the update. And make sure that you do use this check for update box with the option or alt key on a Mac and the shift key on a Windows. Do not use that those functions with the restore iPhone button. It will go through, but you will encounter errors and it just won't work out. So you're going to have to do alt option or shift if you're on a Windows on the check for update box and then you're going to browse for the IPSW and install the software. So that's about it, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and um, I hope you guys have success with this. If you're interested in iOS 9 betas, I highly recommend iOSreg.com. It's fast, and it's secure. It's instant, and they've been doing this for a long time, and this is strongly what I recommend. Do not go with some of these other third-party people who just believe that they can do whatever they want with your UDID. As you can see here, there's been lots of encouragement and support for this business. And this is what I recommend, guys. So I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, please leave a like down below. Be sure to stay tuned for my video on Monday. I'll be going over all of this again. And I'll also have uh, links down below for the download for each unique device beta. So stay tuned for that. Enjoy the keynote on Monday, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.